The revelation of the young and the restless shows that Lily Winters asked Billy Abbott to leave for a while, while he is under investigation for being the shooter in the case of Chance Chancellor. Ray Rosales and Paul Williams are rushing at Billy, and they think they'll find whatever they need in his briefcase. Billy started to sweat, and he asked Amanda Sinclair to protect him in this case. Spoilers for the young and the restless, Lily is asking Billy to leave the media minister for a while. However, Lily believes that while he is being investigated and resolving the matter, he should leave the company. It would be a bad view for them to keep him staying for a while as this is going on and he agrees. However, he wasn't satisfied with that. As it turns out, this isn't just a job. He likes the extra perks that come with it, like seeing Lily every day and wondering when and how the next kiss will be. Someone did it badly. Hopefully, it won't be long before his name is deleted and that he can get back to work. This is the only thing that has kept him on a straight path recently. However, there's always the possibility that he could actually shoot. In that case, it is about to become a very rocky road. What do you think? Was Billy trying to shoot Adam? Let us know in the comments below. Nate greets Lena on the cafe's courtyard, and she says she just talked to Lola about him. She suspects that his appearance wasn't a coincidence, and he reveals that Lola sent him a text message. Elena says she was happy he was there, as she shared too much with Lola about how confused she was, and that she wanted to hash things up with Nate. Elena insists that she doesn't want to give him the wrong impression, since she doesn't know where things are going, or where she wants them to go, but she says she should find out. She implied that if he asked her out, she wouldn't say no. Lola was surprised when Ray dropped by our apartment, and she asked Sharon if everything was alright. Ray reports that his fiance is doing fine, but something is going on with the Newmans. Lola thinks the movie revolves around Adam, but Ray can't confirm or deny that. Lola thought the only thing that would make Ray disappear was if Adam had sex with Sharon again. Ray informs Lola that Sharon has drawn the line by refusing to be the person Adam went to in times of crisis. Ray expected Adam to see it as the ultimate betrayal, and he worried that Adam would see Sharon as an enemy. Lola thinks Adam should focus on the fact that someone tried to kill him. Ray realizes that Adam has a lot of problems he has caused himself, but Ray intends to make sure they don't affect Sharon.